Hello everyone, how's it going? We're back with more Armored Core. Uh, I think we're getting pretty close to the end of this one here. Uh, feels like it anyway, I don't know, I don't actually know how many chapters there are in the game, but uh, I mean, just generally speaking, the way the... Uh, I mean, we, we must have a bit of ways to go. Though. Only, only, I'm judging it only by the fact that the uh, there's two more ranks of, of, of Arena, so... Uh, we must have a, a little bit of a ways to go, so maybe, maybe not quite the finale, but, you know, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Uh, but, yeah, let's just go ahead and jump on into it here. Uh, did I... No, I feel like I changed some things based on, like, fighting stuff in the arena. Did I... S I didn't think I wanted to switch to this head. Let's uh go back to this one. Maybe maybe we should go back to this core too. What legs do we have? Oh, we're back on the okay. So let's switch back to these as well a little bit less armor but more stability and then we can switch to this core it's a big beefy core um i don't know maybe i kind of liked what we had going on let's just stick with these actually uh, and then nah I think I think we're good here I think uh, yeah we'll stick with this what weapons do we have I think our loadout's pretty good too detonating missile launcher so we haven't used that yet I don't think but I'm, I'm anxious to try it out all right so this looks good I always gotta like double check the uh, Double check the uh, uh, the old loadout before we get started. So it's, you know, it's been several days, so I can't remember what we did last or what the loadout was. Uh, and we do have a bunch of these, so let's spin these real quick too. I know eventually I'll have to get these things. Uh. This is something that uh, somebody we, we fought in the arena had that, and it was pretty cool. But I kind of want to max out these uh, this stuff here. Maybe we should go with some extra damage mitigation too, actually. Uh, let's go up to re uh, repair uh, kit effectiveness, and then let's get a little bit more damage mitigation. And then we'll switch to... There's a lot of missiles and stuff. Kinetic it, it, are missiles kinetic damage or explosive? I don't know. Let's go with more kinetic damage though, and then we'll go. We'll, fi we'll finally get a, a level of access speed optimization. There we go. Looks good. All right, so what do we got here? We got to defend the old spaceport, and then we have uh, historic data recovery. Let's start with this one. We're gonna defend the old spaceport. Defense missions really go uh, one of two ways: <laughs> really badly or really poorly. I'm gonna guess the first attempt's gonna go pretty poorly. Rusty back. That concludes the briefing. Good luck. Uh, 
Let's do it. Go. The PCA are going to be fighting to win. As opposed to, to one. what? Don't forget you have MT backup. I do. That's weird. <laughs> Is he asking me to delegate to a bunch of inferior, <laughs> inferior uh, 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 specimens? Oh, right off the bat. The battle's over already. Find out what's going on. Weird. Did we just like lose? Real Raven, and she's got a cool visor. Ah, super cool. I don't think I was really expecting that. Ooh, okay. I wonder if like nothing's happening. I thought I still had I forgot I had equipped that. It's like they repair when I repair. Oh. Ouch. Holy crap. Arena seems like it's going to be much bigger than it is, and it's not. Man, she is wrecking my uh, stability here. Well, all right, so the flamer was not. <laughs> uh, I think we're going to I think we're going to go back to I mean the napalm maybe. But I also kind of want to do the grenade launcher again. Let's do that. I feel like I didn't have a, have a real chance there. Also, I don't know if I'm digging the explosive missile either. So we, we essentially lost the mission we were contracted for and got roped into a battle with the guy whose name we stole. That's pretty cool. It's a ballsy, ballsy maneuver. I've identified the target. That's the mercenary who took your name. Now that I got the right weapons, I can.
I got her to repair first at least. Is she targeted? There we go. I narrowly dodged a pretty big hit there. Ooh, not that time. Ooh, we got her. Oh, now all of a sudden, now she wants to talk. <laughs> You're a little too into the name, bro. Interesting. Interesting little twist there. I wasn't expecting that. No new messages. Well, I guess as far as the defense part of it went, it went poorly. <laughs> For somebody else. Because we're not programmed to call you the thing that you actually named yourself. <laughs> uh. Uh. Well, all right. Let's just keep right on trucking along then. We're going to go uh, salvage some historic data. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I was there for that. I want to go there and survey the area. Even before the coral surge, that place had been all but abandoned. It's an old structure, dating far back into the colonization of Rubicon. There must be items of interest from throughout the planet's history there. As I'm sure you're aware, I have no resources with which to pay you. Well, you are a voice in my head, so... An alternative. If you find any wrecks left by the PCA, you should try accessing them. Both the corporations and the Rubiconians are gathering data on PCA technology. Whatever you collect, I can exchange for credits and transfer the funds to you. Neat. At least they're thinking about this stuff. Like, the, you know... The... Solid reasoning there. I've taken a few liberties. Walter thinks you've gone on a geological survey. <laughs> Thank you for doing this for me, Raven. Is is Iyer just just talking to Walter now? Main system. Oh, why? Let's get started. 
All right. Now, Comrick, the last time I was here, said there were uh, other other areas to go that I missed, like right off the bat. Well, we don't have too much leeway here. <laughs> it's like the soul's run button that I keep pressing it. Alright, there's there's nothing up here. We'll keep our eye out. I also don't know for sure that this is the same place that I was in before. Well, it looks an awful lot like it. Thank oh, this one's not timed. Okay, good. PCA craft data. I'll exchange it for credits and send them to you later. Sweet. Coral is able to conduct data and can influence digital equipment. The effects of the coral surge must have brought some of the wrecks back online. Let's see what we can find. I was worried I wouldn't be able to pay you at all. Oh, wait, okay. So it looks like there's some place to go up here. been since I first saw her voice. Fear not, she said there will always be plenty. She told me this as I was imbibing Rubicon's blessings one fateful day. If I were you, I'd never allow this, I replied, and I was forever shamed by my deceit. This what? Seems to be a recording of Domayan, the Liberation Front's ideological leader. But this appears to be something exceptionally personal. You think? Where was the... I, I, there was a thing here, I swear. Is it up here? I, it must be up here. I see, the waypoint moved. Generation 
know the coral tide is rising at an abnormal rate. The resonance is just some kind of mutation. Run the calculations. How much time do we have? 47 hours, 2 minutes, 16 seconds. We still have time. Deploy IBIS. 47. This was recorded two days before the fires of IBIS. This seems to be about the warning signs of the calamity right before it struck. Not gonna lie, the, the the usage of 47 there feels like a definite nod to uh, Star Trek. Any Star Trek fan would understand that reference. <laughs> There's not even anything to it. There's nothing there. It's just it like the writers of Star Trek used the number 47 for way too much stuff. A lot of these things. Boost. It's a cool, uh, cool map. I do miss not. Uh, I miss having a map. Wrong button. Oh, you're still alive. Assistant number one has lost his mind. His research has utterly consumed him. Granted, there may be some logic to see pulse sensory augmentation of human subjects, but no ethical scholar would ever dare cross that point of no return. Mankind is driven mad by possibilities. What does coral represent, if not sheer potential? This is about the first augmented humans. The same coral technology that created you. But without it, we never would have made contact. Oh, thank God. Um, clearly, like a story mission there. We didn't get money for it at all. We had to do it. We got ourselves a deal, Handler Walter. Michigan. So, Archibus met us halfway. I gave them the heavy warship fleet. In exchange, Balaam's in charge of putting down the beast. They also offered some top Vespers. <laughs> Guess they don't trust us. Vespa? Better than nothing. I'll provide what support I can to. Yeah, you're mad scientists. R.A.D. or whatever. And that hound of yours. Michigan. Don't underestimate 621. That hound always delivers. You know, like, waiting for Walter to, like, turn on us, but, like, he's been pretty good to us. Always stands up for us. It's actually at the point where if he does turn on us, I'll be really, really up. It, it'll hurt. It'll hurt more. <laughs> what kept you, 621? You're a famous mercenary now. Time to act like one. <sighs> this next mission's all or nothing. Make sure you attend the briefing. Nah, I'm going to skip out on this one. I'm going to hold off for a raise. Stun Needle Launcher. Interesting. Is that going to be something I have to use?
Anti-ice worm weapon. Okay, yeah, so I, I am going to have to use this. It does damage, at least. It's heavy. Alright, let's pop it on. I get the feeling we're going to need it immediately. Destroy the ice worm. Sure enough, huh? Massive weapon deployed by the Planetary Closure Administration. Archivists will provide a prototype weapon to ensure a breach of the ice worm's coral shielding. Okay. So this will conclude the chapter. I love how the miners, the mining corporations, were just prepared to do war here. First, some background before we go into detail. The intercorporate ceasefire is now in effect, and we will be carrying out coordinated attacks against the PCA. The targets are the enemy-occupied bases, the heavy warship fleet, and the recently activated... I'll cut to the chase. <laughs> this is an all-out war against the PCA in theaters across Rubicon. And you all got the short end of the stick. You're here to take on the worst of our dirty work, hunting the beast of the ice field. Sure thing, Chief. Tell you what, I'll watch and let you know how badly that goes for us. Gun 5, you just volunteered yourself for the front line. Moving. <laughs> Let's talk about how we're going to neutralize the ice worm's coral shield. You'll be dealing with a yeah, got everybody's. Made up of a everybody's in on this. Guns. cooked up just the thing. A neat little toy we call the Overt Rail Cannon. If we divert the spaceport standby power to the ORC, it should hit hard enough, assuming we land the shot. You can leave that Great. To me. I know a thing or two about I'm sure, shooting. I'm sure it'll hold still for us. But I believe in Rusty. <laughs> Fire. I'll send Chatty. That just leaves the question of who will be taking charge of the stun needle launcher. There was never really a question here. I know just the volunteer to go poke that beast with a stick. Gun 13. You get all that? Good. Time for another field trip. I gotta say, Michigan's growing on me. <laughs> I find him amusing. Do it. It's time, six two one. You ready? I was born ready. Or I guess created. I was augmented ready. Hit this thing in the face with the ice worm, or with the with the needle launcher. Whoa! Oh. You know, if I could. Uh,
Well, I got 30 tries with this thing. I have no idea way, the way it moves. It's like it. You don't gotta tell me. I ain't going down with you fools. Oh, come on. Alright, I see how this goes. Rusty don't miss. I hit the button, but nothing happened. Too many shots with this thing, I can't keep just missing like that. This is going to take a really long time. Where is it? Terrible. game crashed. <laughs> Am I still online? I think so. Well, that's annoying. Oh. You hate to see that. Cheapers, criminy. I panicked because the screen went like dark. It didn't crash in a conventional sense. It like it just went completely dark and I thought like, oh my god, did I lose power? Like did my computer explode?
Thankfully, it just was a game crash. <laughs> Yeah, let's see how bad that messed us up. Weird, I have had no stability issues of any kind. Do I have the right thing equipped? I'm gonna guess not. Okay, I do. Alright, we just jump right into it then. I've already seen the video, so... Man, what a, what a time for it to crash, too, on like the world's longest mission ever. At least I, at least I know what I'm doing now. Swing and a miss. Alright, we did some did some good damage there. Back to square one, gun thirteen. I hit the wall. That was a direct hit. Okay. Did I get it? I don't think so. There we go. Preparing to fire ORC. Energy turbine output at 80%. I don't have any chance we get with that that thing. Recalibrating sites. 90%. Output at 100%. Secondary shield down. Got 13. Then you straight in the face. Chatty, you go for it.
Punk. Nice. Oh! Scratched my head like a dummy. Oh god. That was devastating. Watch out for friendly fire. Secondary shield down. It's all yours now. Something's wrong. Fall back, six two one. I got a Dark Souls Phase 2 going on. Great, I don't have any repair kits either. Good turn. Significant damage. Might be checking out soon to rest. I got robbed. Shenanigans again. This is not the ice worm anymore. This is the shenanigan worm. <laughs> oh, that's extremely disappointing. All right. I think the loadout is good. Although I, I think maybe ah, I should have I should have unequipped the missiles. Can I do that? Yeah. Next time I die. I don't think the, the you know I'd rather have like a maybe the maybe like just like loading up on explosives for this would be good. I hit the button. That was a great shot. I, I, I hit the button. Where did you come from?
Yeah, some like... I mean, I'd only get like two shots though. That's okay. Be something. When that connects, it's pretty cool. Energy turbine output at 80%. Recalibrating sights. 90%. Output at 100%. Secondary shield Lucky to stay targeted on the thing. Okay, we did not take boatloads of damage that time. That's where it all went wrong the first time. Someone got nailed. Looks like things just took a nasty turn. I'll set the ORC to maximum output. We can't afford to lose control of the situation. This next shot will be my last. One repair kit remaining. Who did we lose? Come on, you gotta give that one to me. Bro. <laughs> so, like, I have to get in front of him to, to make that shot, but... Some songbirds. Oh, do I not have songbirds on this side? Dude. Alright, alright, let's let's get out of here then.
Because I don't have... Alright, so we gotta get it for the... The... Am I looking at the right thing here? Yeah. So we need it for the left back unit. There we go. That ought to give us a, a little more of a chance here, I think. It's not every day you see competing forces. I feel like I definitely got robbed a couple times with that that stun the stun needle. Alright, so we, we gotta like kind of just avoid him for this first little bit here. So right now he's just kind of like flailing. Rail cannon is good to go. Don't die before I get a chance to fire, buddy. Tourist, got a message from the chief for you. Enjoy the show, and don't forget to smile. Oh. I should just I'm just gonna restart now. <laughs> There's no way. It's too long of a far too long of a mission for me to like try to go further and then get all the way to the end again with no repair kits. That did some that that did some major damage. Do we like skip a phase?
Too slow. I'd love to. This guy would cooperate and line up. You gotta be kidding me. Hey, they gave me one. So we got to the phase three pretty quick. They really they they bite it hard. Like the second <laughs> it goes into phase three. to the side. Alright, he's gonna swing this way. Oh, he did it. Wow. All EML modules connected. Energy turbines at full capacity. Output at eight. All right. Here we go. All emergency valves closed. Disabling limiter. 100. Rusty's. Oh, don't, don't blow it, Rusty. I did. It's finally over. The blast will contaminate the area. Get out of <sighs> Coral voices. Lost again. Raven. There's something I have to tell you. Is this the kind of thing that should have been up front? It's my family. 
my brothers and sisters. I am but a single wave, born from the coral tide. I'm a Baconian without a body. No one even knew I was there for such a long time. Raven, you're the only one who... Dang right I did. Cool. Alright, on to chapter four. The temporary alliance between the Archibus and Balaam group. It's definitely feeling less like a Dark Souls story, and, and it's, it's feeling a lot more like a Final Fantasy story. Devastating the Planetary Closure Administration forces and exiling them from Rubicon. Raven, they're, they're contaminating the Mako. That dealt the decisive blow. Archivists, through their own engagements with the PCA, using it to make materia. Strength with seized weaponry. The balance of power was broken. The scales tipped in Archivists' favor. And the Rubicon Liberation Front's win. What's up, Tereba? How you doing, buddy? Were dashed. I was softball today. With the loss of their common enemy, the rival factions' war for the coral abruptly reignited. Well, that didn't take long. And their bitter conflict burned with renewed intensity. Played well, good. This is this is the. Do you have more tomorrow? I, you said this was the last weekend. It's common, it, like, it, it's weird to me that, like, they're after this, uh, this resource that apparently just moves on its own and gathers. And that doesn't tell you it's alive. Probably the only one tomorrow they played too well and got into a harder bracket. Oh, okay. Aww. Hey, maybe not. Maybe they'll surprise you. They'll, 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 they're the, they're officially the underdog favorites now. That puts them in a good position. Don't, don't try to turn me on, Walter. Registration number RB23. Call sign, Raven. Your records have been updated. A rank virtual encounters are now available in the arena. All right. May these encounters further guide your technique. New parts available to purchase. Let's check that out. Uh, a linear rifle. What does that mean? It's almost like, uh, okay. So is it similar than... Goes in a straight line. <laughs> I'm crime fighting beaver. Handgun, burst handgun. That would be a handgun that bursts. The little gem bazooka. Uh, seems like it does a good bit of damage. Almost no ammo though. That makes me nervous. Uh, jamming bomb launcher. Now is this like our? Oh, 
It's our second laser rifle. We haven't used any laser rifles yet, actually. Laser shotgun. Okay, cool. Explosive thrower. <laughs> I wonder what that does. <laughs> oh. Jamming bomb launcher. I just, you know, you're, we're, we're throwing out his of the 70s on that one. Some jamming bombs, man. Uh, surprised to see no new melee weapons. There really hasn't been that many. Like, there's a couple here. Laser blade. Laser lance. That sounds pretty cool, actually. I wish I used melee weapons in this game. One of these days. Spread bazooka. That's what she said. Uh, diffuse laser cannon. Spread laser cannon. Ugh, I don't like spread weapons. All shield launcher. Missile launcher. Split missile launcher. Dual missile launcher. Uh, okay, so this fires two homing missiles. Laser turret. Oh, I gotta try that. All kinds of new stuff here. I've been trying this, uh, Where did it go? This one. This is the... The active homing missile launcher that fires two. So this fires... So this, this is something I might actually try too. That's expensive. Alright, this is a pretty cool head. This one's pretty good, too. We're going to blow all our money. That's what we've been saving our money for. We don't lose too much speed with this either. I think we're doing it. Yeah. New core. Expensive as heck. Holy crap. Very heavy. I can't spend money. No, I, I have to save it all in case I need it later. <laughs> uh, very heavy. This is a, a very heavy tanky core. Oh, finally some, like, attitude stability. I will save up for that. These are heavy. Not great on firearm specialization, either. Who's that? These are, like, what the heck are these? Oh, my God. Look at these things. <laughs> I can't... I can't walk around in broad daylight with these as a mech warrior. <laughs> you approve? They are. Uh, they look to be quite heavy, but it looks like they're going to hold a ton. Uh, some slower more stable tetrapod legs. These ones are at least like a bit tankier than the other ones. Very stable. Very stable stuff.
I am su also surprised there has not been like there's only been these two uh, tank legs since the beginning of the game. Some new boosters, new boost goofing. Quick boost thrust. So we'd lose a little bit of doge. But they're pretty energy efficient. We get more boost speed. Overall good thrust. It doesn't seem like uh, doesn't seem like the benefits are worth the loss to the quick boost. This would be like my if I if I'm not taking missiles into a a, a fight, then this would be the fire control system for me. Although with explosives, I mean. Maybe something like this would be a little bit better. It's not a huge... I mean, this is like just marginally better than, than what I have. It's old, too. Do you enjoy some missiles, though? Not bad. Lose a little bit of attitude recovery on that, but we get quite a bit of energy output. Not great for energy weapons, though. Am I using a lot of energy weapons? That's the that's the the ticket. I guess if we stick to kinetic stuff. Um, let's do it. Let's have it in the old uh, repertoire. The only thing I really want to get rid of is this. I, I'm not going to use that a lot. I want to try out this laser turret. So that's an energy weapon. So maybe we don't switch to our... Uh, our new um, engine for that. I feel like uh, this is a really good core to have. I like that this one's better with generator stuff, so I think that's why we're sticking with that one. Yeah, I think... Uh... I think for now, well, I think we're just basically going to stick with what we have. If the turret is is awful, then well, we will have learned a valuable lesson. We can switch to that at another time then. Uh, what else did I get? The new plasma missiles. Let's try them. Okay. All right. Do we take these to the arena? I think we have to, right? Gun two. Let's see what we're in for here. Arena combat aptitude evaluation program number seven. You have now reached rank A. Subject A. Rank at what? <laughs> <laughs> Come 
commencing evaluation. Main system, activating combat mode. We. Much faster than other plasma missiles, which I like. I don't know if I know how these. Uh this turret works. Mind if I do plasma armor? Oh. Oh. Alright. Don't like the laser turret because I have no idea what it's actually doing. Let's stick with that for now, and then maybe I do love a songbird. Plasma missiles seem to be working pretty well. Bad hits there. I fired in the grenade. It's a wrong, super wrong time. Come on, move. Yeah, I'm. I'm like waiting till these like missiles are about to hit me, and then I'm like, oh, they're right there. I think I'll stop in midair and shoot a grenade. False armor too, punk.
That was a big yawn. <laughs> Did I yawn? It was nearly two minutes ago. I don't remember that. Uh, okay. So this guy needs a little. That's what she said. Nice. <laughs> oh. Uh, the bazooka. It's a little quicker. I think instead of the songbirds, we'll go back to the... Hmm. I mean, we could go like straight up plasma missiles. I'm a huge fan of these ones here. Hmm. Let's do this. Let's go with... Let's give that a try. Gotten them close. We just got we're just a little sloppy with the old uh, those homing missiles of his. Oh, we got him. Honey, man, misses for the win. Target destroyed. Concluding evaluation. Well done. Not a pretty victory, but a victory nonetheless. Nail. Will we finally get to fight this guy? <laughs> He's gonna whoop my butt. I guarantee it. I've been talking smack on this guy the whole game. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program. Number six, rank A. Subject AC. His his awesome. mech is smiling at me. It's a pretty cool emblem though. That's like a tool album cover. Main system activating combat mode. He's got some rage. He's shooting at me already. 
for him to like whip out some some crazy thing. That was a pretty definitive victory. Target destroyed. Concluding evaluation. Well done. <laughs> Not gonna lie, it was very satisfying to finally kill him. I thought he would put up a little bit more of a fight, though, considering how much, how, like how, how his attitude is. I expected to have a little something behind it, you know. <laughs> 